first yard sale of the day. Got a pretty huge score in this bag. Got a uh, 64 Super Nintendo, bunch of games. Paid up a little bit, $86. But there's some good stuff in there. I'll show you later. Hi, so this is my uh, pickup recap. I could have probably stopped after that first garage sale. That was the only games I found, but it was a it was a really good score. Um, I did find a few other things out and about, so I'll just get through those real quick. First off, I found two Walking Dead books. They're not uh, graphic novels or comics, but still pretty cool. First editions. I don't know if that matters. I also picked up a uh, Xeno Saga for a buck. And it doesn't have its manual, but it's all right. Picked up some like, B horror movies. So we've got Evil Dead 2, VHS. Everybody wants that. Astro Zombies, VHS. And then also Dracula, Frankenstein. Started to look for horror on VHS. Some of those B, Z rated stuff. Another thing I got was Jenga, Spider-Man. And it's actually brand spanking new in the package. Hasn't even been played. So it's pretty, pretty awesome. That was also a dollar. So yeah, that was a dollar, dollar, dollar. Books were like 50 cents. So one other random thing that I picked. Let me, uh, let, me, uh, let me take you with me. Surprisingly, this is probably my best find of the day. Got these oil paintings. Um, bought them for $5 each. They're signed by the guy yes see it in both of them but they're 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 you know nice <laughs> and on the back he also signed them again and uh gave like a title to him it has like paperwork the guy's name is uh eugene schmidt he's from uh germany but he's in santa barbara right now Got a little letter from the queen. I don't know. Anyways, I think this was a great find for five bucks. There's not very many listings of them, but they seem to go around like 200 bucks. So I think that's pretty, pretty good. All right, so to the video games. One second. So that bag had these two consoles, has the 64, three controllers, and the red expansion pack. And all the joysticks are all right, not bad. So here's my first yellow Super Nintendo. It's not like gold, but I don't know, I said it works. Here's my first mouse as well, two controllers. So I got the two systems, and now let me take you to the games. So this lot came with a 16 games, 11 Super Nintendo, 5, 64 games, and I guess I'll jump right into it. Came with a little stack of manuals. Got the, the mouse, Super NES mouse, instructions, Super Nintendo instructions, Yoshi Island. Mario World 2, Donkey Kong Country, an instruction booklet for The Illusion of Gaia, which I didn't have, so I'm like, where's this game? Got Mario Paint, Perfect Dark, and another game that it didn't come with, uh, Majora's Mask, which is a little unfortunate, but it's all right. Got some good games. So, for the 64, I got a copy of Perfect.
perfect dark, great condition. We have Yoshi's story. Also, looks great. Yeah, Mario 64 looks pretty, pretty beat up. Some label damage there. Mario Kart 64. And The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. So, yes, I have all of these games. So those are gonna be a trade or something. Or I try to recoup some of this costs. Cost me $86, like I said, paid up. The guy was gonna start looking stuff up and I didn't really want him to. So I just offered him all that I had in my wallet. So luckily he took it. I think it was a, I would prefer to spend less, but I know it's a good deal. So to the Super Nintendo games, you have the ubiquitous Mario World. No surprise here, Mario Paint had the mouse, had the manual. We've got the Lion King. Tough, tough game right here. Wait a second. Oh, I have two Mario Paints. This one's pretty rough, pretty beat up. Super Street Fighter 2. Turbo. No, Super Street Fighter 2. Fatal Fury Special. Then, got some good games here. Saved the last five are probably the best. The ones I'm most excited about playing. So, this is actually my second copy, but it's still it's a great game. Yoshi's Island. And... Then Donkey Kong Country, which is surprisingly my first copy. So happy to have this. Pretty awesome. I still need another one. Let's see. Super Double Dragon. And the reason why I kind of bought this lot is like I saw this in the bag and I was just like, alright, let's just let's just, you know, let me just buy it. Here's my money. So, got a Castlevania 4. Pretty excited to have this game. Um, yeah, that's pretty awesome. And then, I had a nice surprise. I got home, I didn't even, I was quick. I didn't really look through everything. Also got Super or Contra 3. The Alien Wars. So, those are all the games I got in this lot. That's all the stuff I got today kind of expanded my pick and range because I don't find lots of video games like at every single I might find one lot of video games a weekend so I'm going to tons of garage sales I gotta keep it interesting so I've started picking up different things just looking for cool stuff anyways thanks for watching thanks for hopefully subscribing liking you know, let me know how let me know how you think I did and I'll come back again, hopefully. I wanna I'm getting back into this little garage sale and picking game. So thank you.